Okay, to get started, I'm on pixabay.com, which has a bunch of free background images that you can use for your thumbnail. So I'm just going to select one and download it for my project. All right, let's get into Premiere Pro and double click in our project panel to import our newly downloaded background image. Then drag your background image onto your timeline. Next up, let's select the text tool and click in the middle of our background to add our text. And then I'd recommend using the selection tool to reposition the text where you want it. And to resize it, just drag one of the corner handles. To change the font or color of your text, let's go up to Window and select Essential Graphics. In this panel, you'll see all kinds of options you can format your text with. The main thing you should know is that before you change anything, make sure your text is highlighted with the text tool or it won't work. For example, before I change the fill or color of my text, I'll need to make sure it's fully selected. Moving on, any good thumbnail should have an image, so I'm going to drag this one I imported earlier above my other two clips on the timeline. And of course, you can resize your image or move it around with the move tool. Finally, once you're done editing your thumbnail, click this camera button under the preview to save a copy of your thumbnail to your computer. Just make sure you change the format to something usable like JPEG and make sure you know where you're saving it to. Okay, and that's it for this quick tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.